okay so as you know that our rifle is now fully functional now let's open up the animator so in the animation let's open up this animator window okay as you can see right there let's me add the game window right there as well okay so in the animator if you check it out we already have the animation set up for firing and reloading and everything okay if you don't know how we did that you can just go ahead and watch the previous videos when we were animating our player we already did all of that now the only thing which is remaining is to implement the all animation to our rifle so first of all we will start from our switch camera okay open up the script and right here let's add a reference to our animator so we will first of all add a header by the name of camera animator let's create a public animator and let's name this as animator as well then down below right here when we are aiming and walking then we want to play some specific animation so first of all we will say that animator dot set bool and what we want to do we want to set the idle to false okay and after this we will say animator dot set bool we want to make the idle aim to be true because if we are walking and aiming then we want the idle aim to be true as well and after that we will say animator dot set pool and we want the aim walk to be true and also if we are aiming and walking then we want the walk to be true as well because if we remove our finger from the aiming button then the player will still be walking okay so that's why we want the walk to be true as well so let's set this to true and let me show you these parameters right here if we check our animator okay here is the idle idle aim walk fire fire walk and reloading okay we already have set that in the previous video so just you can go ahead and watch that video okay so we have added the animation for aiming and walking now right here if we are just aiming then what we want to do let's just actually copy these animations okay and paste it down below let's move this one and the when we are aiming we of course want the idle to be false we want the idle aim to be true and then we want the aim walk to be false and we want the walk to be false as well because we are just aiming and after this in the else block if we are not aiming not nor walking then what we want to do so just copy and paste it again and right here we will this time set the idle to true and this other thing the idle aim and the aim walk can be set to false and let's remove the walk from there that's it so this was animation for the switch camera okay or you can say for aiming this was our aiming animations now if we just simply save this get back to unity let's change into scene and actually let's get back to the normal mode okay and let's open our player body then dominant mesh and right here we need to add a reference to our animator so just simply drag and drop the player game object it will automatically pick up the animator okay as you can see now if we play the game you will notice that our animation will be working perfectly fine okay as you can see when we are aiming it is playing the aiming animation as you can see okay and now if we are walking and then the enemies comes right there and then we aim and try to shoot him as you can see we can aim and shoot the enemy as you can see okay and then if you stop stop aiming we are back to walking now we, we are aiming as well now if you just stop walking as you can see we are still aiming okay so our 
aiming animations are now working perfectly fine now in the next video we will add the shooting animation and the reloading animation to our rifle so catch you guys in the next one